What's good? It's your boy Tad Money, and today I'm gonna go through my crystal collection, uh, my crystal book collection. You know, this is not all of it. This is the main ones that I'm focusing on when it comes to learning about crystals and stuff. You know, so chakras. You know, crystals deal with the chakras, points, the energy uh, centers, and within our energy bodies and stuff. And uh, I want to go through my crystal book collection. As you can see, these are my crystal book. These are not all of it, but these are the main ones that I'm reading right now. You know, sleeping in the bed with and stuff. Now, you know what I'm saying? I'm on the other side of the bed. But as you can see, these are my crystal collection. Now, these are mandatory for those who want to learn about crystals. You know what I'm saying? Mingle with crystals. For those who can't do yoga meditation, for those who can't do any type of spiritual practices, crystals are there to help you, to motivate you, but also, could, you know, help you be in tune with the frequencies and the energies of this earth and everything else. Like I just bury my two amethyst crystals, my two big amethyst crystals. I'm going to dig them up and around, around the, the week of my birthday, I'm going to dig them up and stuff. Cause you know, right now I want my two big amethyst crystals to, to absorb the earth's energy as much as it can. That's why I'm keeping it in the, in the ground, in the dirt in my backyard for a while. You know what I'm saying? Until summertime, until around my birthday week, and I'm gonna dig them up, and you know, the energy of them crystals is gonna be outrageous. I mean, you know, I read, you know, I got a hoodoo book. I'm gonna go through my African traditional religion books as well. But I got a hoodoo book that says, you know, when you bury your crystals in the in the soil of the ground of the dirt and leave it there for a while, you know, the vibration, the frequencies of the crystals will, will be strong and powerful. You know what I'm saying? So I just, I, you know, I did them yesterday and stuff. And um, did yesterday when it was raining and I dig a hole in my backyard and I put my two big crystals. I kissed them and put them in the, in the soil and, and put the dirt over them and stuff like that. So, you know, when it really come down to these are my uh crystal books right here now. Now, when it comes to the chakra Bible and also... You know what I'm saying? The crystal Bible, these are important to have if you want to bring the religious side of your spirituality in, in your atmosphere. So as you can see, um, the chakra Bible is important to have if you try to get into crystals. The crystals are kind of the chakras, but the chakra Bible, these four books right here, these four books right here, I, you know, I got this in the beginning stages of my spiritual journey and also my new age journey. These are the first books I got when it comes to the Bibles and stuff that represent the things of this world. But not the things of the world, but the, the metaphysical things of the world. You know what I'm saying? So these four main books, you can get off of Amazon's. To, I, I recommend Amazon because Amazon is the best choice. Because you got to understand when Amazon first started, it was a book website. You know what I'm saying? Nothing but a book website. And it still is. And it got amazing books. That whole bunch of books you know what I'm saying even though you don't want to make amazon rich i understand all that but at the same time amazon got the resources and the books that you need to really get this now when it comes to these two but i got this from barnes and noble and you know i'm out of town basically in fairfield in california but i got these two crystal uh healer books from barnes and noble I got this book from my metaphysical store within my town, Vallejo, which is called Psychic Reality. They use this book uh, to, you know, they, they use this book to tell people about the crystals in their store and stuff. So when I saw the people in the, in the meta, in Psychic Reality, you know, using this book, their book is dirty and messed up. But, you know, what I'm saying they, they use this book, you know, to read um you know what I'm saying? All of them. This is an important book to have, man. According to the reason, and also this because of this book is the reason why amethyst are my favorite crystal. Because amethyst, it represents, it stands, it can, you know, this book tells that the amethyst crystals and it represent, um, you know, um, that you want, if you wish to live in another dimension or another, uh, another realm or something, wish to live in another dimension or realm, that book's, uh, and this book basically explains what the amethyst crystals are about, and that's why I like amethyst crystals. If you want to know why I like amethyst crystals, get the book of stones right here and stuff like that. And I got this from the Crystal Council website. I just ordered me three crystals off their website, but I'm still waiting for them to ship it. But this is a good book to have as well, and, and the top of it represents the seven chakras. You know what I'm saying? But this is an important book they have. And also, you can go on their website, you know, Crystal Council. Let me see if they got their website. You go on crystalcouncil.com, you know what I'm saying, to get their crystals, you know, support them. You know what I'm saying? Support them. And this is their website right here. So, you know what I'm saying? But this book is amazing, though. I'll read this book whenever I get the chance to. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, you know what I'm saying? This book is amazing. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how y'all. So, 
As you can see, y'all, these are my crystal collection, but it's not all of it, though, but these are the main ones I focus on, you know what I mean? So if you want to get into spiritual practices, if it's hard for you to do yoga, meditation, or lucid dreaming, or astral projection, or any of those type of spiritual practices, get crystals, man. Learn about, definitely learn about chakras, you know, okay, representing, you know, crystals connected to the chakras. You know what I'm saying? But get get these books off of Amazon. You can find these books off of Amazon besides this one. I got this off the uh the Crystal Council website. It's not this book is not on Amazon, but you can get it off their website. But and you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, these are important books to have when it comes to your spiritual journey and your new age practices, whether you are a mystic, a cultist, or a neo-pagan. doesn't matter what you are, uh, African traditional religious, whatever you want to call it. And these are important to have and keep, you know what I'm saying? So this is your boy, Tad Money, and I know that's what I want to say. So be on the lookout for my other videos, and stay tuned. So peace.